guys panda here um, doing a quick uh, soft topper review after uh, about a year of owning the Toyota Tacoma with uh, the soft topper up top here um, <coughs> great topper six foot bed uh, I'm about five foot ten and uh, I sleep in the back of my topper uh, I figured uh, I don't really need to haul a lot of weight like so I don't need the rooftop tent so this is how um, my setup is but uh so far everything's held together pretty great as you can see uh you know on the trails over time i don't know if you can actually see it uh there's like little dirt marks i mean if i really tried with some elbow grease i could probably get it out, get it out. <clears throat> but um so far everything held together pretty fine there's no water leaking in um, the only thing when sleeping inside i guess you know you get the water condensation other else than that not pretty bad. Not bad. Um, it's it's roughly 25 degrees here. Uh, it, it gets cold at night. <laughs> um, I would definitely probably in the future recommend a uh, probably diesel heater, but uh, for summer camping, perfect setup. So sorry for my little mess back here, but um, I have an IKEA twin mattress here, and then uh, I layer it up some blankets, pillow. I'm about five foot ten twin mattress fits back here I can sleep fine roll around fine um, it actually fits two people me and my girlfriend <clears throat> just uh, my little setup here I have a little stool so I can climb into the back of my truck because uh, I have a, a little lift and uh, makes it easier for a lady to uh, climb in um, my mess back here but uh, I got my safety box and other medical supplies and you know my snuggle buddy that travels with me everywhere and uh, yeah at night we just roll out plop up uh, snuggle in. I like it so far. Another awesome night. Wake up in the morning, you know, you're in the woods and, uh, not exploring. But, uh, here we're at, uh, Lake Wenatchee. We made a quick stop. But, um, last night was, uh, pretty fun. Sorry. <laughs> Back to the top review here. Um, rain. Uh, doesn't bother me. Um, it doesn't go through the seams. It doesn't leak into the cabin or the back to bed. So it's a, it's a good setup. Um, definitely, uh, you know, if you have like the ceramic spray, you know, sprayed on, it'll, uh, kind of helps repel the, repel the water a little bit. Other else than that, great product. Um, would definitely recommend it if, uh, you guys want to, you know, do camping on a budget or, uh, truck camping and, uh, don't want to haul around a lot of weight. Um, Yep. Reach out to me if you guys have any questions.